Monica. <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> wait a minute. Is it on? I think so. Is it on, honey? Is it on? Is this thing recording? I'm trying to see. Do we got anybody coming on here? Oh my God. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I'm trying to wait to see if the thing is oh, really. Yeah, there's some people. Oh my God, there's some people coming. Whoa. Oh my God, is this thing recording? Well, the red light is flashing, so that means yes, it is. What's up, YouTube land, Twitter land, Instagram land, Snapchat, Grinder, Scruff, BGC, and all the lands all across the land. This is your girl, T.S. Madison, and I'm here loud, live, and in color for the Star on Fox after show, darling. And oh my God, this show is sponsored by Fox, and don't you ever forget that. Mm -hmm. And um, my very special guest tonight is Miss Brittany O'Grady. Say hi, Brittany. Hey, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. Yes, uh, and, and tell them what your, who your, who's your character on the show. I play Simone Davis on the show, um, and I'm a part of Take Three with Star. Star's my sister, and Girl. Alex, one of our best friends. Girl, it's so much stuff. It's so much tea that you need to pour in my cup. I came all the way down here to sit with you oh. to get this tea poured in well, my I cup. I should have gotten the pot started. Well, the pot is starting because you're sitting next to the pot. I'm the tea <laughs> kettle, the pot, the tea, the sugar. The sugar, definitely the sugar. Mm, I like and, that. And, and all the good stuff. Okay, so tonight's show, uh, let's see. I want you to talk about this episode tonight and how did it make you feel? Tell me how it oh, made you Oh, gosh. Feel. Um, made me feel very sensitive. I feel like there's a lot of exposure, um, exposed feelings that are happening between all the characters. Sister, I got a question to ask mm -hmm. you. When you was locked on with that girl, how did that make you feel on the inside? Wait, wait which, which, which one? What you mean, which girl? How many girls you been kissing? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> kissing and, and woo. I know. You really been you really have started to explore the world. Yes, wild side. Simone is definitely Well I'm been, talking to you in a in a Simone in uh, Simone care. Yes, you know, yes. Care. Um I Simone I think is starting to find who she is, and I think a part of that is sexuality, mm. and um, a fraction—just only a fraction of who we are—but a very important, a very important part of who we are, and um, and it it gets better as well, the I'm, season I'm, I'm unfolds. Like I don't want to, I don't want to spoil well, it. You can't spoil it because yeah. you, I'm not gonna let you spoil oh, no, no, it. Okay. But I'm just gonna, you know, I'm gonna fondle around yeah. with it a little bit. Now that Simone's see what's gotten some action, finally. So that's a lot of fun. Now, I, the, yeah. the biggest question that was pondering on my mind is who in the hell, I ask this to every guest that come on, who in the hell killed that big girl in the jail? Somebody killed, she didn't kill herself. I'm oh. not going to, I'm not going to sit up there and believe that that woman oh my gosh. killed herself. That, right? that was just a very, it was such a deep scene. How, um, she, how she got out there, sister? Give me the secret. Oh my gosh. It, well, it they had a stunt double on a harness. Was I not supposed to give that away? <laughs> I'm sorry. I knew it took a harness, buddy. Oh, and yeah. I'm not being Macy because I'm a fat girl myself. But oh. I knew it took a harness, but I knew it was some type of well, I think that they would put anybody in a harness just so they wouldn't actually hurt themselves. I'm being like, messy. Oh, okay. It's like, I'm sorry. I take things too literal. Oh, I'm my God. I'm being so messy, girl. I love it. No, you no, no. You write them a messy trap. I'm, I'm being so messy, but you know. <laughs> okay. Oh. Somebody said, I told you the janitor did it. That is so funny. Oh, my God. Your song in the beginning of this episode, Slave. Oh, thank but, you. But who is he that you're singing about? Who is who is he? Um, I would definitely ask the music department. I don't know who he is. Um, is it he or she? Mm. Mm, I, well, that. you know, it's interesting because I always question, like, it's so interesting we chose that song for the court scene. So he's mine, better get your own. When I, when I was doing the dance sequence and it had a whole it had a whole dance number like I went on the desk and threw papers at people mm -hmm. but it got edited out. I was so sad. I was like, oh. Why are you but sad? I, I was like oh. <laughs> all that hard work. Uh, but um but uh I just kind of interp I was it was kind of you know, I, I just interpreted it as um as kind of like Simone letting out her anger through those lyrics in the song. But I didn't really Necessarily figure out who he who, is, who he or she is, who he is. Mm -mm. Now listen, Kiki, Kiki has uh, has her hand in a lot of drama that's going on this episode, right? Mm -hmm. So is she trying to be helpful, helpful, or is she trying to be devious? 
Oh my goodness. You know, I think about that all the time. Um, especially just with the episodes that we have filmed. Mm -hmm. What are her intentions? Mm -hmm. And it, it, it gets a little shaky. What do you think, like, outside of being the character? So oh. What do you think? Tell me. You know, if I, if, like, as an audience member seeing this tonight, I felt like that's her life and that's what she feels is best for her career. I think um, Gigi, or Kiki's character Gigi, mm -hmm. sees everything through her career. So she's anything so to boost ugly. it is positive. So she's trying to be positive towards Alexandra and get her on the same level. Ooh, that Alexandra. Ooh, ooh, girl. Mm -hmm. Listen, now, let's talk about Alex and Noah. I'm, I'm reading this stuff here. I, I took so many different notes because it was so much stuff going on. I, I just wrote all over the papers and <laughs> I wrote so much stuff. It's so much oh. happened tonight. So tell me, what do you think about what's going on with that? Ooh, I think that it's gonna get tricky. First of all, Noah belongs to stop. Oh yeah, no, for sure. He definitely does. He belongs 100%. to stop. One hundred percent. I'm, I'm, you know, I, I've got my eye on Noah. I got, I, as you know, Simone doesn't trust men, so. I don't trust men either. I yeah, just, no. I don't trust them. I just charge them. That's all. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I, I definitely. I'm very picky with, with the. People specifically of the male persuasion. Male persuasion, uh, yes. I love a male persuasion. It's so tasty. Uh, but <laughs> but listen, no, no, we do know that that I, I I personally like like I said last week. I think that Alex, excuse me, that uh, Star and Noah make a good couple. Mm -hmm. I just I think they make because they, it's, he's the bad boy, she's the bad girl, and it's just like they got a good chemistry together. together. Yeah. And I just chemistry. it's just something about them that just makes me want to see them like together, not just together in a in a in a lustful like, mode, hope, but yeah, together okay. in a like I'd like to see them together because they bat they they're they're the bad boy, the bad girl, and it's like. They might can calm each other down. What you yes, mean? Yes, I absolutely agree with you. Yeah. I feel like um, Noah and Star are kind of parallel. They see each other in a way that nobody else can see them. And I think that a lot of people see them on the surface level and not at their <laughs> core. Well, actually, I think a lot of the audience to see them at their core. But I, I think in, in the story, I think Noah and Star have the same... Um, kind of but girl, did you makeup. see how Noah got over there in that hot tub and naked, naked like that, all naked and dangling, yeah. everything, everything was jiggling all everywhere, mm -hmm. just jiggling and got in the. I started a hashtag called New Noah. <laughs> <laughs> New Noah, mm -hmm. did you get you a pee? No, I was on set that day. Oh wait, oh, uh, what does it look like? I, um, is it cute? Have you ever seen the eggplant emoji? Oh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oh my God! <laughs> you got me over here showing that fox gonna spank my behind by doing that stuff. Oh, it's okay. They'll spank mine right uh, after you. Listen, high heel and I yama. <laughs> listen, we prayed. Me and Miss Lawrence, excuse me, Miss Bruce. Last week, we prayed so much. Last week, we prayed. We prayed for high heel to get up off of that stuff, them mm -hmm. drugs, that alcohol, that cocaine, mm -hmm. that cocaina. We prayed that he takes that stuff up out of his nose, up out of his system. We also mm -hmm. prayed. For Derek's legs. Oh, yeah. And something magical happened in the spirit. Just all of a sudden tonight. I did, we will get to that part. Yes. But I want to talk about Ayana laying down with Hayya. Hayya must got, it must be the, the perfume he wear. The cologne. It must yes, be. cologne does a lot. Um, I think it's, I think it's a cologne. I think it's, uh, I think it's his. Uh, sex appeal that he's got going now, on. He do got a lot of sex appeal. Mm -hmm. And I mean, he's played by Benjamin Bradley. Of course, but yeah. But yeah. The, he's played by Benjamin Bradley. But his, but but Hayil, the, the character, look a mess right now. He get them drugs all, got them all strung all. I don't like that look on him. Yeah, I yeah, drugs like aren't a good look. I, well, Simone. But Ayana, <laughs> listen, it didn't stop Ayana though. It didn't stop Ayana. I don't know what it. What do you think it is about? Uh, 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 Playboy men being able to seduce. Women like that. What do you think is? What, what do you think that is? I think they're sociopaths. Yeah. Or is it just a? Is, <laughs> is it? Is it the tip of the tongue that they say, "Come here, girl. Let me talk to you." Ah! <laughs> oh my god. Come here, girl. Let me talk to you real oh quick. My let me whisper something in your ear, girl. What you, you think is that? Oh my gosh. I. 
Yes. I do. Yes. <laughs> Oh my God, I know it's that. Trust me. Yes. I know and it's I think that. It's, yeah, <laughs> I think it's all of that. Now, let's get back on Derek walking and dancing. Like I said last week, uh, Miss Lawrence, aka Miss Bruce, and I were we were here on the after show and we prayed. And it looks like the Lord and he, the Lord answered so quick mm -hmm. because I seen him up dancing and singing and, mm -hmm. and, and walking around, but then it ended up being a dream. I'm going to talk to Lee. He's I breaking dream. too many people. Uh, breaking too many people's hearts. A, a, a simple fantasy that she wished was reality. That you... That's what they thought. It just, you know, she thought he was going to walk that in. That was there. beautiful. But let me tell you something. Tonight, he confessed that he got a Woody. I'm really happy for him. But who did he get a Woody with, though? was not Alex. No, it wasn't. Do you think it was that turban, that turban around that woman's head that made him? Oh gosh, well. Do y'all think it was the turban around that woman's head that made him get that witty like that? I, duh, I think that sometimes when it doesn't matter who it is, sometimes if you feel a physical touch, it can, it can spark something. Like this? Yes. Did it spark? Yes. Girl, it'll set you on fire. You better be careful how you touch it. <laughs> <laughs> so, I mean, do you is is Alex in jeopardy? Like, do, do you think that mm -hmm. she's like? Does she have something to worry about? I really, I think that the really beautiful thing about Derek and Alex, or the really, I think that the most important thing in a relationship is honesty. Mm -hmm. So. As long as both parties are honest. She ain't honest. It works. She ain't all the way honest. She ain't told him everything yet. So, um, she ain't so honest. we'll see, because Derek seems incredibly honest. But she ain't honest. And and Alex needs to work on her honesty. If if, if her if her nose is like Pinocchio's, it would it would be as long as eighty five. It's the Woody. Off. Yeah. It would be long as, as Derek's Woody. Longer. <laughs> Longer than his Woody. Ooh, Jesus. It's getting real hot in here, girl. I, know, I need to put on the air. <laughs> it's getting real hot in here. Oh, my God. So, let me ask you a question. Is there anything that you could tell us about uh, your character's art this season? Oh, gosh. I think Simone's definitely figuring out who she is um, and battling with her emotions and her situations in life head on. For the first time. Mm. I think that she put a lot of her pain aside to help the group move forward and now she can't help but have to deal with it now because the pain just becomes bigger if it's not hurt. So. so how different are you from Simone, Miss Brittany? How oh, wow. different? What? I think we're pretty different. Um, uh, very different. I, you know, I was fortunate to grow up and a really be beautiful family. Mm -hmm. um, we, I have an older sister, um, Caitlin. Hey, Caitlin. Hey. What's up, baby? <laughs> <laughs> my, my, um, my sister, Caitlin, my mom, my dad, my little brother, dogs. Love my dog. Um, What's his name? Rusty. Why wouldn't it be Brody? Oh, um, you know. <laughs> you didn't you just catch the joke. Because, you know, oh, no, no, I know. Just because. <laughs> My dog is sweeter than those type of dogs. So the viewers want to know, what do you think about Brody's intentions? What do you think? Mm. He ain't your daddy, so you don't really think about him too much, do you? I get together. We are, we are, you, you, you know I'm Benji. Oh, I, I... You know I'm Benji. We will get together and whoop where he is. Mm -hmm. We are girl. I out. think I... Yeah, I don't trust him. You don't trust him? I don't... Either. Yeah. <clears throat> Trust him. Just don't trust He's him. not my dad, so I don't trust him. I don't trust a lot of people. Men especially. Yes. Mm. Yes. So, and Brody coming up into juvie, giving me food. Did okay, you? yeah, that that was that was good. That that broke down my walls. Okay, okay. Yeah. Listen, everybody that feeds you, you don't know what he was feeding you, girl. That that don't mean your friend because he gave you a plate. 
McDonald's give me a two piece, a, a two piece, uh, uh, excuse me, a ten piece chicken nugget. That don't mean they my friend because they still trying to kill me with all that. Oh fake. my god! So you don't know, you know? Yes. Sister, now I got a question. Mm hmm. I see Ayana and Carlotta are really bumping heads a lot. This, mm -hmm. like, they are bumping heads. Yes. Do does Ayana know that Miss Carlotta would tear her ass up? Does, she must don't know about Carlotta's rap. Shoot. I think she underestimates Missy. I think she under because she's a church going woman on the outside, church going woman, wholesome, taking care of three girls. But I don't think Ayana's aware of. Her badassery. Wait a if minute. That's even a Who word. told you Miss Carlotta was a church going woman? Who told you that? Miss Carlotta told Simone that. So Simone kind of believes it, but can see through it. Simone's mm. not as aloof as she comes off. Listen, I've been watching that since the season started. It, honey, she, everybody ain't everybody that say they saved, they ain't saved. Mm -hmm. That that woman will still tear your ass up. Oh, absolutely. You know. Some people just. Now, girl, listen, I took some more notes. I got... Uh, now, look. Ooh. This is how I took notes in school. Did you see Noah tonight almost fell in Miss, Miss Bruce's trap? Oh, yeah. Noah had done had too many Belvedere's, baby. Oh, my goodness. He had threw too many drinks back, honey, and Miss, Mo, Miss, uh, Miss Bruce almost captured him in the web of deceit. Oh. Talk about her name. What was her name? What was Miss Bruce's name tonight? Tasha, Tamika. Uh, oh. What was it? The many, uh, we should call Miss Lawrence and see. Well, Girl, when I tell you, I um, I like it to have died sitting there and Noah's like, hey, baby, what's your name? That, listen, that's exactly how the trades fall into the trap of the girls. They have too much of that Belvedere. Or, <laughs> or, or, or at least they always, uh, they try to blame it on the alcohol. Sometimes they know exactly what's going on. Because that toupee that Miss uh, that, that Bruce wears. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. The gig is up, girl. The, the gig is up. <laughs> and it's okay. <laughs> it's all good. So let me see. Oh my God. Let me see. I wrote some other stuff. Baby. Cotton. Cotton. Sister, let me tell you something from a sister to another sister. Uh, Simone said, No, cotton. I was sitting here on my couch screaming, Yes, cotton. Yes. Cotton, go out there and get your man. Cotton, let that man come home from that prison cell and throw you on that bed and ravish you and love all over you, sending, sending you all those good, good jailhouse vibrations all up and through your body. Did you, did you, what did you think about that? I thought that I needed to go sage Cotton's room. Why? <laughs> Why she can't have no man? Oh, she can totally have a man. No, but that and, man. And, uh, oh, cause, cause my spidey senses are tingling. I would, listen, her, something on her was tingling too. I don't oh, know if that sure. was her spidey senses. Uh, oh, for sure. But something I, was tingling on cotton it's, too. It's not hard with with those situations, especially bad boys. I I I, I really do feel as though uh, it might be a bad situation. Oh no! You, listen, some situations. Not judging a guy locked up, but when. I'm not, yeah, I'm not. I'm not judging. Sister, I, you was just locked up. What you mean? Yeah. Yeah. You You're right. Just I'm in gonna. I, I don't have an opinion anymore. That's right. Cotton, you do you. That's okay? right. I got my prison bag. Girl, you was just in prison, and you got you a prison bag. So why Cotton can't have? I totally her forgot. Listen. We're matching. That man came here. He, he he startled her and started ravishing her and threw her on that bed and began to make sweet love to her. Girl, I was just jumping up and down in the spirit world saying, "Praise God." After Praise he stalked God. her. <laughs> you ain't never been stalked in love like that. Oh, girl, that's a transsexual's dream, honey. Oh. We love that. We love being stalked and, and loved on like that. Oh, my it. God. Stalk me and love me, baby. Listen, send me one of your friends over there from the, uh, 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 from the, from the, from the penitentiary. Tell them to call me. <laughs> Collect. <laughs> All right, I've got them on speed dial. Give yeah. me just one what second. What you doing with them on speed dial like that? You told me you don't like me in like that. No, 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 no. We're going to have to keep watching you. <laughs> All right, I'm about to answer two questions, and then I'm going to wrap the show up. So we're getting down here in the comment section, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see what they're saying. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Uh, Jamel Van said, y'all are twinning in jail. Okay. Oh, yeah, I got to ask you this. Like, listen, we're going to be off for two weeks. 
But the I drama is still going to be, you know, boiling and boiling and boiling, honey. Mm -hmm. So we're going to be back November 29th. You, Empire, Star, going to be back November 29th. I believe so. Yeah, it says November 29th. The girls is going to be back, honey. They're going to be back because everybody's sitting over here like, baby, Thanksgiving is coming. So let's see. All right. Jamel says, if Carlotta owns a salon, why she always have the worst synthetic wig? Don't y'all say that. Why would y'all say that? If Carlotta really loved them and sees their mom in them, why won't she make... I can't see the rest of the comment. I don't know why. Oh, my God. Why y'all reading her wig like that? Okay. They said, uh, what's Simone next move? What's Simone's next move for Star? Well, Ayana just gave her a key to her place. So I think she's setting up shop in the nice part of town with Ayana. With Ayana? In what way? You forgot to close your shades last night. <laughs> okay, let me see. Um, oh, my God. They're in these comments. Okay. Okay, Bob now they said that Miss Carlotta's bob wig was lit. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me go. Are you seeing yourself? They say, are you signing a separate contract without the girls? So far, we're all together still, take three. Um, mm -hmm. Even though Simone's taking a different direction in her lifestyle choice of living without the girls, just because there's nothing that Miss C and the girls could have done to get Simone out. So, Ayana, so far has been the only one to help her temporarily. Girl, I got to write this down because it seems to me somebody down there thinking it's going to be an escape situation or a TLC situation or a In Vogue situation. You know how them girl groups go. You know they go to split and they go to parting like the Red Sea. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, sure one more question and then we go on. Listen, y'all make it quick because baby, we got to get something to eat. Look, you see, look, don't don't read that comment. Just oh oh oh. You see okay. that comment? Don't do that. Mm -hmm. But okay. it's okay. Nothing hurts me. <laughs> they let kidding. the devil use them. Look at them. Let the devil use them. Look. Okay. Y'all stop letting the devil use y'all. Ask the woman a question. Okay. Will they bring Naomi back to intensify the drama next season? Alex's mom. Ooh, I hope she comes around. Um, we don't really know. Yet. Mm. Yeah. Will Simone have a love interest on Star? You do, don't you? Yes. What's. She can't say. Okay. Let me... You gotta wrap it up. Okay, so. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we gotta wrap this up because y'all ain't asking no questions down there. Y'all talking about Miss Carlotta Wigs. I told y'all. <laughs> Did not talk about my sister's wigs like that, honey. Let her have her potty caps in peace, Father God, okay? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Star on Fox will be back November the 29th. So please, go back. If you miss anything, go back and watch it. Pr pr take your DVR, watch it, honey. And, and remember, last week, me and Miss Bruce prayed over Derek's leg. And look at God. He got up and started walking and dancing tonight. Walking, dancing, and singing, and all that type of stuff. It was a beautiful song. But it was only a dream. He used to read Word Up magazine. <laughs> Salt and pepper. Whoa. Oh, look, wait. Look wait. at that one. What it said. <gasps> <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, we gone. Y'all, y'all, we got to keep this thing PG-13. Y'all a mess. We will see you guys next week. And thank you so much for tuning in to Star on Fox and Empire. And ladies and gentlemen, this has been the after show sponsored by Fox. We love you and we'll see you not one, but two weeks from now. Two. 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 Give Peace me, out. Give me some sugar. Give me a little bit of that, that Belvedere that uh, uh, Noah was drinking because it had him going crazy. Oh. 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 Miss Bruce almost got her a piece of that. <laughs> Pass the Belvedere. <gasps>